You filled out the paperwork, had your facilities approved, and the Mustang Heritage Foundation selected you for the Trainer Incentive Program. Now what? Once you've made an appointment with a BLM facility to have your horse picked up, you must so haul him in an approved trailer. Wild horses need to be hauled in a stock type trailer with a full rear swing gate, a full top, and they must have sturdy walls and sturdy floors. The floor also needs to be covered with a non-skid type material. In this trailer we're using a one inch rubber mat. Also, it is required that you have a middle cut gate or swing gate. This aids in case you have to separate your Mustangs by age, size, or sex. Alrighty, when you're ready to pick up your tip Mustang, you need to go back through and check your facilities one last time just to make sure that the fences are like they need to be and there's nothing sharp or protruding and that there's adequate feed and water ready for your Mustang. Now, when you head to the BLM facility, it's very, very important that you show up on time. These guys have a lot to do and, and they've gathered your horse specifically for you at that time specified. When you get there, if you'd like, you can have a BLM, att BLM attendee put a halter on your Mustang before loading you, which is what we're going to do now. Now, after you have your Mustang haltered and loaded, it's also really important to head back to your approved facility and unload him as quickly as possible. You know, head straight there and, and it's just safer for you and the horse.